Hi guys, welcome back to Just Claire Creates on this International Scrapbook Day. So this challenge is to stitch something. So get out the sewing machine or do some hand stitching or just draw some dashes that look like stitching. So for this layout, I am using the Day by Day collection from Minte Papers um, and my Studio Calico notebook for this picture of a flower that I have. So I've used the floral paper to back the left side and then I'm creating a stitched pocket with some wood grain paper and this vellum, which I think is Magical Forest, um, with these like rose gold rainbows on. So I just used some coral thread, which kind of matched the color of the flower in the photo and the flower on the paper. Um, so I stitched all around that and then I just stuck it around the edges as well so that it made a pocket um, between the page and the wood grain paper. So then I got my photo and I've just skipped through where I was sort of adding some of the layers on. So there was another paper from this collection that had the florals on and then just some um, peachy colour papers. I've used a dark blue paper for a tab and I'm just adding on a doily. Um, and I've just sort of creased up some of the edges on the papers just to give it a bit of dimension. Um, I've used two more of the papers from this day by day collection to make some tags and I've just punched a hole and added some reinforcers um, for the top part and then I spent ages deliberating about um, which sentiments I was going to use so I've cut a lot of that out so I was just going backwards and forwards with these few pieces um, but I decided to go for this grow like a wildflower piece sort of tucked inside the layers um, and every photo has a story on the left hand side because I really liked the font of that with the florals. And then I'm just adding on some gold foil thickers. Um, so a leaf one onto the photo, a butterfly in the top right corner. And then I decided to go for like a, f a leaf one for the corner of that um, every photo has a story little piece. Um, and I think that was everything that I did for this layout. So I hope you enjoy doing some stitching um, on your Traveller's Notebook layouts. I would love to see how you do some stitching. Um, make sure to share your photos in the Facebook group. And I can't wait to see what you all make. Thanks for watching.